Hello, everyone. Welcome back to the last week of our MOOC on sustainability and development. We have covered a lot of ground in this class. We have talked about climate change. We have talked about poverty and inequality. We have talked about biodiversity and conservation of ecosystems. And now it is time to bring all of these different threads in the class together. We will do that by focusing on what is called sustainability science, a new field of scholarship and analysis that takes both sustainability and development seriously and considers how to address the different problems associated with sustainability and development. What is sustainability science? Before we answer that question, it is useful to think about what is sustainability. Sustainability has been defined in many different ways, but one of the core elements of a definition of sustainability is how we can ensure the well being of those who live today without compromising the well being of those who live and who are going to come in the future. So, how to manage, how to work in our current context without making the life chances of those who come after us worse off. And sustainability science is the systematic study and analysis of how to make these different kinds of trade-offs possible. How to ensure that the different dimensions of our existence, the environmental, the social, and the economic, can each be attended, can each be assured for all people on the planet. So in this, in this sense, sustainability has three pillars, the environmental, the social, and the economic. And we are going to talk about each of them as we discuss and pull the threads together of the discussion and the analysis that we have done till now on climate, poverty and inequality, and ecosystems and biodiversity. Sustainability science can be thought of as a new scientific approach that underpins research on sustainability and development. But it is not just research that sustainability scientists care about. It is also the practice of sustainability. In this sense, it's the core framework for thinking about and researching and practicing policies related to human and environmental interactions. There are two key thrusts in sustainability science. One, to bridge the gap between research and practice, between science and knowledge. The second is to connect the social, the ecological, and the professional sciences, thus to create an interdisciplinary science that can think about, analyze, and provide advice for how to manage the relationship between social environmental and economic domains of our existence. Sustainability science in this sense moves beyond much of the ways in which scientific knowledge is pursued. Much of what we think of as science, which is often undertaken in separation from the world of practice. And that is particularly true of the social sciences. Sustainability science instead seeks to make the connection between research and knowledge on the one hand and between practice and policy on the other hand as close and as intimate as possible. And it does so by drawing on all kinds of disciplines, all sorts of knowledge to address real world problems. The two key areas of sustainability science thus suggest that any research on sustainability needs to be interdisciplinary. Real world problems of sustainability go beyond disciplines and therefore it stands to reason that they cannot be addressed by focusing on and bringing insights from only a single discipline. Sustainability knowledge must be interdisciplinary. And second, there must be a strong relationship between science and practice. The world is moving rapidly towards unsustainable outcomes. It has 
trajectories of change that cannot be sustained into the future. This direction, this movement must change. But to make the change possible, we need to connect science and practice, knowledge and decision-making much better. So sustainability science is also closely concerned with questions about when it is and how it is that scientific knowledge translates into real-world practice and decision-making. 